Another annual festival is altered to meet social distancing guidelines. This year's Zabawa Polish Festival in the city of Erie offering food to go. It's good news tonight at 6. Chelsea Swift joining us now live outside Holy Trinity Catholic Church with much more on the turnout for this year's to go version of Zabawa. Chelsea. Hi, Sean. The Zababa Polish Festival is just getting started. In the first hour, they've seen over 200 customers, people waiting in line to pick up their Polish food to enjoy at home. But right now, I'm here in the kitchen with organizer Ray Leninsky, and he's going to tell us a little bit about what you're serving. Hi, Chelsea. We have everything that we normally do except a few items we could not get this year. So behind us, they're frying the pierogi and the onions, as well as the potato pancakes. Inside, we have some other stuff being warmed up. Due to all the regulations, we kind of split the kitchen areas up this year so we can keep the food lines fed. Uh, all the stuff was made here in the parish over about the last three months. It's all frozen. We bring everything together for these days and get it out and feed our customers. And so I've heard that there are actually ways for um, people to purchase items here that they can make at home. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yes, we have some limited quantities. We actually kept some of the pierogies frozen, as well as some of the potato pancake batter. So being frozen, you can take it home, stick it in your freezer, enjoy it yourself whenever you want. It's kind of like a little option to take a little further than just the two days here. That's great. Thank you so much. Thank you. And uh, the festival continues all weekend. Uh, patrons can purchase Polish, Polish food as well as merchandise. For a full look at uh, everything the festival has to offer, head to our website, yourerie.com. Back to you, Sean. Always a good time at the Zababa. Thank you, Chelsea.